Hi. Okay, so I thought I would vlog today because um I was like, do you know what? Um I'm going out to Tesco's later on today and then tomorrow we're going out so I thought, do you know what? I thought we'd join them together and just a vlog um what I'm doing. Um so I'm just gonna brush my hair, just put my clothes on and I've just taken my tablets. It is 12 o'clock and um, I thought I would just give you a, a quick update on what's been happening since my birthday um, and then um, I will vlog obviously going to Tesco and stuff like that. So, also how cute is this blush? Like, it's the house thing <laughs> Um, I got that from Morrison's if you are wondering. So, um, had a really lovely birthday. Um, even though obviously I was in lockdown. Still enjoyed it, no matter what. Um, and then, well, since my birthday, um, a couple of days after my birthday, I'm going to say like, um, I say like at the weekend, Richard's mum um, has got Alzheimer's and she hasn't been doing too great like recently. Um, and she keeps having quite a lot of falls um, and one of the falls, on her last fall she had, um, she um, actually broke her hip so she went to the hospital um, and she had an operation and she had like a pin put into her hip basically. And then we were waiting for her to obviously recover from that and then obviously go back home. Um, but it wasn't now like, looking good um, and then she developed a chest infection and from the chest infection she actually got the virus um, and uh, we was like oh my god you know you'll be sick um, and then, um, from then, she was just getting, like, worse, basically. Like, they basically said, look, she hasn't got a uh, long left to live. Um, and, uh, she actually passed away Monday? She passed away Monday. So she did passed away yesterday, which was Tuesday, so she passed away on Monday, like, tea time. Um, so, yeah, which is mum is no longer years anymore, which is absolutely good mention. Like, obviously Richard um, is very upset. Um, so he literally got to work, and he got the phone call as he arrived to work, so that she passed away. So he came back, uh, no, no, straight to his dad's. Um, and then she came back home and then he had yesterday off and he's got today off anyway in his shift um, and I don't know if he's going back to work or not tomorrow, I think he is but at the moment he's gone out um, I think he's going to do something with his car I think he's tired um, so I'm not going to come home um, so yeah, I'm like gutted for Richard and his dad because now his dad's living on his own and plus you can't see anybody because of this flipping lockdown and the virus. So, yeah, obviously we are keeping in touch with him, his dad. Um, but, yeah, um, we actually don't know what she's passed away from. Like, we don't know if it was the virus or not. Nobody has told us as of yet, but we will obviously find out. But, yeah, oh my God, I can't believe it. Um... Crazy. And also, um, 
the day she passed away was actually Richard's dad's 90th birthday. So it's crazy, absolutely crazy this world. So yeah, I thought I'd just let you know. Um, I know it's nothing exciting, but it's something that has happened. Um, so that's why I've kind of been a little bit quiet on vlogging. Um, and then today we are going to Tesco, me and my mum, um, to get my nan and auntie shopping, but obviously also some stuff for us. Um, and then tomorrow we're going out to uh, the garden centre because the garden centre is reopening from today. And I s think I've mentioned it that I want to get two guinea pigs. Well, um, we're going to like see how much they are and like the stuff that we need to get for it. Like, I've got the hurt, which is still like doing some bits and bobs with it. It's like built and everything like that, but it just needs to have like a few bits. Um, and we've got the food, just need to get like the bowl for the food and water and like some toy things and stuff. So, yeah, obviously, I'll vlog when I get them. So, yes, uh, the reason why I want two guinea pigs is. I know I've got seven budgets, but um, I don't know, I just love pets and I've always wanted to guinea pig. Uh, before I got um, Holly, which is our first budget, um, I said that I wanted a guinea pig or hamster. Um, but my mum was like, it's like too much effort and stuff and obviously I was in school, so I wouldn't be able to look after it. But now I'm not doing anything as of yet. Um, I was like, you know what, I'm going to get two guinea pigs. But I don't know what's going to happen, like, if we go on holidays. Like, obviously, because we've got a British and a guinea pig. Don't know about that. It's fine. We'll, we'll figure something out. So, yes, I thought I would vlog. Um, but, yeah, I thought I'd just update you. Because why not? Um, me and Tom are still fine. Uh, still talking. It's actually our five-week uh, relationship anniversary um on friday and we still haven't seen each other <laughs> but obviously that's because of lockdown but yeah um still doing good love him and everything and he's doing great um so yeah obviously i would tell you if things weren't going great but they are we're doing fine um, so yeah, I think I'm going to watch some Gossip Girl because um, I've got nothing else to do and it's like 5 past 12 and I don't know what time we're just coming home and um, I don't know if he's actually coming home. Also, I don't know if I showed you, I got a new phone case from Rish, this is from Rish, it's like pink with like a big fluffy zipper and it's like silicone. I also have like another one. Um, it's in here. Two minutes. <laughs> this pineapple one. That's like a galaxy pineapple. It's actually really nice. And this is also from Rish. Um, I've still got some more phone cases to come from Rish. Like a good couple more. But I'd, they're coming at like either this week or like they're coming before end of May. I know that. So I think they're coming from like next week. So, very excited about that. Um, I might switch this actually because I've had this on for a little bit and I like to switch my phone around. I hope my phone case is around because I don't know. I've lost, well, I won't say I've lost a lot of other ones, but I just can't find um, where my other ones are because I've got like a friend's one, a pretty little liar's one, and another one, and I can't quite think of where they are. So, yeah. I'll just update you on vlog. Um, so yeah, I'll see you when you go to Tesco's. Um, which will be like, I don't know, around like 3, 4 o'clock time because I don't know what time my mum finishes work. But yeah, um, I've got to obviously have dinner and stuff like that. So yeah, I'll just update you. I'll see you later. Also, I really love my camera. Hope you guys like this quality and if it's like any better let me know if it is better quality like with focus picture sound anything just let me know i do need to get one of them like ringed stopper thingamabobs i'm not going on i don't know if we ever going to go on holiday this year 
because I've seen this lockdown. Um, this is the seventh week in lockdown. I think it's uh, great. I mean, they are easing it very slowly. I mean, we are actually allowed to meet one other person from outside the household, so that I can meet Talon, but you've got to keep like two metre distance and yeah. Um, I can't meet Tom because he's vulnerable, like my nana and my um, I will obviously, um, I'm not going to tell you why as of yet, but me and Tom have created a YouTube channel and when we do meet finally, and we are like meeting regular, then we will talk about it and everything like that. But for now, you like, you don't really need to know. So yeah. I'm going to go and have a see you later on. I'm going to put like um, a headband on when I go out because my hair is way too long. Once obviously this lockdown is over, I can obviously go to the hairdressers. But until that, I can't. So I think they're going to be like the last year open as well as like pubs because they're not important in a sense. But yeah. Outside. All right, so it's a bit later on now, and I thought I would vlog the outside of my house because basically got some chalk the other day from Tesco, like wait right last week, yeah, last week time, and um, I put some stuff on outside our house. So I thought I would show you guys. So I did this. It says save lives, protect the NHS. Do this rainbow with the NHS. On it stay home and these are what we drew that's Richard's and there's this what I did did they call like hot beat and these are like wooden that as well colored in like a floor and then I did like a house and then I just did this says we love NHS and yeah this is outside of a house. Alright so it's um we are on our way to Nan and Auntie's and um, to just pick up some money for their shopping um, and then we're obviously going to go to Tesco's and get that uh, their shopping. They don't want like well they do want I will not say a lot but right. a bit um so I do Nana and Auntie's and we does ours um, because then we can both go in together without being told oh, you're only allowed one person in from your household so um, yeah, we're just going down to Nan's um, and then off to Tesco which I'm very excited about um, so I don't know if I can vlog in Tesco I'll try my best like I'll try my like in the aisle probably like upstairs where I can hide because <laughs> there's not a lot of people about what we did upstairs so sorry totally forgot to vlog in Tesco because I didn't even bring my camera who does that don't really matter in here. so I'm not sorry really but we just arrived yeah. at my nan's and I'm about to continue the shopping um in my man uh Richard came with us but he already was out up. before us um like just a much around the shops and no, stuff no, no, no. Uh, I've actually bought something which I've been wanting since like March but never had the money and I still didn't have the money but it's locked down I and I needed up? it so I um, I'll do the unboxing I I'll do the unboxing of it once I get home Um, it was a big Perch, well, I wouldn't say a big purchase, but it was a lot of money. I'm glad I purchased it because it's entertainment and I needed it. Because I'm so bored now, I literally have run out of stuff um, to do in um, the house now. So, yeah, I need to go go and see my nana and auntie. But um, when I get home, I'll show you um, doing unboxing of it and stuff because I'm very excited to set it up and I'm excited to play with it. Um, so yeah, Tesco's was good, it wasn't too busy, wasn't like awful, um, and actually didn't do anything wrong for change because normally I like go up like the wrong lane and I have to like go down and 
what is that for? So yeah, I need to go because my mum's just gone and bananas open the door. And she'll be wondering why on earth is my granddaughter not coming with me. Um so yeah, be happy. Um I'll see you in a Alright, so it's so I put back on noise, but my mum won't put it on silent because she wants to do that to give him rather speech to so sugar. So this is the thing I got. I mean, and the switch light. Um, the handheld version of the Nintendo Switch card. Uh, I didn't update on TV on TV, like the card thing. I got in yellow, they had yellow or blue, and I was like, I could play yellow. Did you have pink on our house? Yeah, I was like, I'll do the testing in there. And I got one game, this is Dirt 7 played. And I got Animal Crossing New Horizons because everybody lives about this game, and I was like, it could be like entertaining. Um, never owned one of these, or I didn't know how to use them. Or she was like a Nintendo. Um, I was gonna get like Mario Kart, but yeah, that's another 44 pounds in there. I'll wait a bit later on um, to get that. So, I'm gonna open it. See how we can drive them. Hey! Here comes my kids on The social distancing guidelines. I know, so I don't sit sanity. Yes. Uh, when Is the you got your and the wiggle stop? Well, that's a shopping place because that didn't keep you up at your wiggle stop. Okay, this is it. Quite cute little. Quite big actually. And then so you can put this the is from Laura, who is from and Laura asks there is a lot of talk about people being able to meet up in meet up in family clusters or bubbles. Where are uh, when are we likely to see this put in place? Well, the guidance that we set out... Outside. A cat would put it outside. I don't love it. Because that's all that cat. Yeah, the cat. Okay. 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 Okay
Mm. 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 There are named contacts within councils and the NHS for each care home, particularly the smaller care homes, the smaller independent care homes. You might have uh, traditionally. No, because it started uh, at seven, eight, 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 eight
off with it um, and then we should be able to get them pretty soon um, very excited about that, I want to get them today it's so bad yet darling no, better, I can get them today and keep them inside we've got them what, 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 in? in the playpen we haven't got a playpen well that's why you buy one no, we didn't need to um, sat another's way, yeah. We actually knew it way. Oh, no. By Mamma, which was all said and good. Um, I'm gonna go. So, um, I didn't bring you in because um, obviously it's a bit like, you know, awkward now to play, like vlogging and stuff. Obviously, we don't have a guinea pig. Did try and cook, so it didn't work. Um, no, but we've like, took, we must took some pictures and stuff of like prices and things and that. Um, we've asked questions. And we've asked questions and we tried to get a book but we didn't have any. They had one on like hamsters and budgies but we have we know enough about budgies. <laughs> so we don't need to get a book. Um, and um, they did actually have a guinea pig, it was one boy. Um, and she says like it's better to get them in twos. Um, so they can have like a companion. That's what I said to my mum. And she was thinking I would making it up so she could have to no, but it's, it's the truth um, and we just spoke about it and that um, and the best we got them in every like few weeks and stuff so we're gonna like obviously by the time within the few weeks hopefully the more things might be open <laughs> mid up so yeah I mean you all that you only have to do like the flooring in it and that's it that's who we're working tomorrow, this is working tomorrow now. Yeah. Um, so, heading off home now. Um, it's a very nice day, isn't it? Yeah, it's nice and sunny. Cool, it's not like, it's not it's not cold air. Cool, it's not like freezing cold, but like, it's, it's nice. Cold does in the air. Yeah. Um, so we're going to head home now, it's 4.51. So. We've we'll got to go and get Auntie Dawn's prescription. And get Auntie's prescription. Um, so yeah, I will probably see you on something else. Um, I'm not doing much, but yeah, I'll be googling. We're just trying to make what we've found and yeah, stuff. I'll be googling that. See if there's like any forums I can go on. And, so, um, and she says that you can go to like, the library and get like a book. But we don't know that's going to be open. I will see you in two seconds. Alright, so back home now. Um, and it is 5.55. Uh, um, so we didn't go straight home because basically we had to go and pick up um, a prescription from Angie. We went to go and deliver it, then we spoke, and then came back home. And then we spoke to Richard for a bit. <laughs> um, like, saying like, what we've done, like, about the guinea pigs and that. Um, so I'm going to have a Google, a Googly Google, um, on some stuff, on um, my laptop, um, and then I think I'm going to play this again. I've got it off to it now, because this morning it was like shouting at me saying, please charge me. And I was like, okay. Um, <laughs> So I'm gonna do. Um, I've only got one game for this Nintendo. But, um, I did want to buy two games, but why are they so expensive? Like Nintendo, if you're magically watching this vlog, why are your Nintendo Switch games so expensive? I'm not gonna lie. Um, like why would you pay for it? It's quick for it. Um, I mean, I did, but that's because I couldn't just get a Nintendo without a game. A bit pointless, wasn't it? And um, I really wanted Super Mario Kart, but it's 50 quid. I can actually buy it, like not the game cartridge, but like download it, I think. For 50 quid, maybe not. So I'm mad about that. <laughs> so once um, I get some money coming in, okay, um, like I've made it for my granddad's birthday, I'm having money to come in. Then. I've still got this one left over from 
uh, banana and that's it yeah. but until then I'm just going to play Animal Crossing um, so yeah, let you know um, back home now with the noisy birds we didn't actually see any budgets we didn't have no budgets except finishers but um, obviously we're not going to buy them we did have a guinea pig it was a boy and I really want to get it from mum and mummy everyone so yeah, um, so I'm just going to do some Google and then we have them to and stuff like that. So obviously you have to have some Google and I don't know how and what I found out and stuff like that. 